There it was in the distance, a tall black horse standing at the water's edge, its dark glossy coat shimmering under the moonlight, drawing you in with an almost magical allure. But with every step closer, the serene scene transforms into something sinister. The horse's eyes gleam with evil intelligence, and before you can react, it begins to shift, revealing its true form. The Kelpie is no ordinary horse. It's a shape-shifting spirit lurking near Scotland's waters, waiting to drag unsuspecting victims into the depths. But what makes this creature so dangerous? The Kelpie. Danger from deep Scottish locks. Welcome, my fellow Methusiasts. It's time for another intriguing mythology that'll keep you glued to your screen while exploring the mysterious dark locks and waters of the Scottish Highlands. Today, we unravel the tale of the Kelpie, the shape-shifting spirit from the deep. A story that will leave you questioning whether it's a myth, a dream, or the simple truth. You may wonder, is this just a tale to scare children away from the water, or is there something far more sinister at play? Let's uncover the ice-cold truth behind these mysterious water creatures, so you'll think twice before approaching one. If you've ever wandered near the water's edge in the Scottish Highlands and spotted a beautiful black horse grazing peacefully, you might have paused to wonder if that serene creature was truly what it seemed. This is no ordinary horse. It's a being of striking beauty, with a coat as dark as the night and a mane that seems to be perpetually dripping with water. But beware, this alluring creature is likely an evil water spirit, capable of dragging unsuspecting victims to a watery grave. You wouldn't be the first to fall under the Kelpie's spell. Standing by the shore, it looks like it's waiting for someone to climb on its back. But this is no gentle creature. Once a rider takes the bait, they find themselves stuck. Its skin becomes adhesive, binding the rider to the creature. With terrifying speed, the Kelpie plunges into the depths, dragging its victim beneath the water to drown. But the Kelpie's shape-shifting doesn't stop at its horsey form. Sometimes, it takes on a human guise, appearing as a tall, rough-looking man, or even as a beautiful woman. In these forms, the Kelpie can lure its victims even closer, charming them with its appearance before revealing its true, deadly nature. This deceptive transformation makes the Kelpie even more dangerous. How can you protect yourself when you don't know what form the creature will take next? Scottish folklore is rich with tales of spirits and creatures that embody the land's wild nature, and the Kelpie is amongst the most famous. The origins of the Kelpie myth are ancient, stretching back centuries. The waters of Scotland, whether in the form of locks, rivers, or seas, have always been a place of mystery and danger. The unpredictable nature of these bodies of water inspired stories of malevolent beings that could rise from the depths to pull unsuspecting souls under. Some believe that the Kelpie myth was a way to warn children and travelers to stay away from dangerous waters. With its captivating appearance and ability to transform, the Kelpie represents the peril that lies beneath the surface. The unpredictable nature of Scotland's weather and waterways, along with the deep cultural connection to the land, made the Kelpie a fitting symbol for the dangers that lurked in the unknown. Despite its evil nature, the Kelpie was also seen as a creature of immense power. It was said that if you could capture one, you would gain mastery over it. The Kelpie possessed the strength of ten horses, making it a valuable ally if you were brave enough to try and tame it. The key to controlling a Kelpie was to steal its bridle. If someone could manage to take the bridle, they could command it to do their bidding. One famous tale tells of the Laird of Morphy, who captured a Kelpie and forced it to help build his castle. The Kelpie, bound by its stolen bridle, used its supernatural strength to carry huge stones that no human could lift. But after the work was done and the Laird released the Kelpie, the creature cursed him and his family. According to legend, the Laird's line eventually died out, a grim reminder that even when subdued, the Kelpie's vengeance was inescapable. So, how can you tell if you're near a Kelpie? There are several telltale signs that the creature might be lurking nearby. First, listen carefully. The sound of a Kelpie's tail striking the water is said to be like thunder. If you hear this ominous noise, it's best to move away from the shore quickly. Some legends also say that Kelpies will howl or wail before a storm, another warning that danger is near. But the most obvious sign of a Kelpie is its appearance. If you see a horse standing near a body of water, and its mane appears to be dripping wet, 
You should think twice before approaching. No matter how beautiful or gentle it looks, this could be a deadly creature in disguise. And if you see a beautiful woman or a tall man lingering near the water's edge, don't be fooled, they might be more than they seem. Interestingly, some people believe that the Kelpie legend may be connected to another famous creature of Scottish folklore, the Loch Ness Monster. While the two are often seen as separate entities, there are similarities between them. Both are water-dwelling creatures, and both have inspired fear and fascination for centuries. Some believe that the Loch Ness Monster could be a modern-day version of the Kelpie, or perhaps a distant relative. An intriguing idea, right? If you haven't seen our video on Nessie yet, make sure to have a look. When Christianity spread through Scotland, it brought new interpretations to the old Celtic myths. In this new context, the Kelpie was often associated with evil, or even seen as a manifestation of the devil. The idea of a malevolent spirit that lures people to their death fit well with Christian warnings about the dangers of temptation. The Kelpie's ability to shapeshift into a beautiful woman, in particular, was seen as a metaphor for the seductive nature of sin. This shift in interpretation didn't erase the old stories though. Instead, it layered new meanings on top of them, giving the Kelpie a dual identity as both a symbol of natural danger and a representation of moral threat. The creature's myth evolved, but its core essence, a mysterious and deadly force lurking just below the surface, remained unchanged. Nowadays it remains a popular figure, and it has inspired countless stories, poems, and artworks, and it continues to captivate the imagination of people around the world. In recent years, the Kelpie has even made appearances in modern media, from books to television shows, where it is often portrayed as a powerful and enigmatic creature. One of the most famous modern tributes to the Kelpie is the massive sculpture known as the Kelpies in Falkirk, Scotland. These two towering horseheads, each 30 meters high, pay homage to the mythical creatures that have haunted Scotland's waters for centuries. The sculptures are a reminder of the enduring power of the Kelpie legend and the way it continues to shape the cultural landscape of Scotland. So, it's fair to conclude that this creature is more than just a myth. It's a symbol of the beauty and danger that coexist in the natural world. Whether as a warning to stay away from treacherous waters or as a reminder of the dangers of temptation, the Kelpie has fascinated generations. Its story continues to be told, not just in Scotland, but around the world. If you ever find yourself near a loch, remember the tales of the Kelpie. And if you see a lone horse by the water, or hear a strange sound in the distance, it might be best to keep your distance. After all, some legends are born from truth. On that note, we think there's something fascinating about a creature that walks the line between beauty and danger. What do you think? Would you be brave enough to face a Kelpie? Or would you try to wake yourself up from the scary dream? If you enjoyed this story, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more mythical tales. Stay curious, stay adventurous, my fellow enthusiasts.